Hi guys, Ian Fair here again, and I want to try my hand at a Minecraft mod review. Why? Because I like to try new things. And I tried this before and I got my ass handed to me, quite literally. I'm going to tell you a story before I start this. Lazily sipping on my fruit punch while I do so. Basically, the mobs that are in this mod, which is all this mod is about, is these mobs, are pains in the butt to get them to fight you. Obviously, you have to have your game in at least normal. I did that. I have most of you probably already know. I have the Mo Creatures mod. In my Minecraft. The first time I tried this, not only did I die ten times from the mobs I'm about to show you, an ogre destroyed part of my house. It wasn't good times. I did have it posted on YouTube for a few hours. Two people saw it, one of them being me. I decided that I should tr just try it again, and I deleted the original video. If you would like to see the failure video, I can re-upload it for my humiliation. But that will be your choice. Anyway, back to this. So, this is my attempt at a mod review that doesn't suck. Um... And I apologize for the lag and the bad quality. Um, I can't get graphs to work for more than five seconds, and I don't I don't know how to use graphs, so I have to use my webcam software. And the highest it will go at recording my screen is 480, I believe 480. So. I'm sorry that the quality is low, I don't know how to solve it, and I'm not going to download a ton of different programs onto my computer unless I know that I can trust them. So here we go. This is the Mo Chickens mod. I am now in my chicken pen, my beautiful chicken pen, that is in the basement of the basement of my house that the ogre had destroyed and that I had fixed. Um, basically what this mod does is it puts in a bunch of new chickens into your game. Now some of you may have seen mob re mod reviews for this before, but I have noticed that the ones that I have watched have not included every single chicken. I have. So I'm going to show you every chicken that's available in this game and the effects that they do to you when they try to beat you up. Because every one of these chickens is hostile. Um, and there's only one of them which I don't know how to tame. If someone does know how to tame it, let me know because it's not said on the mod on the mod page and it doesn't drop anything special um, as far as I know. So I don't know if it can be tamed yet. I, I don't know. This is a work in progress mod. Uh, they want the mod makers do want to add new things, and of course a uh, link will be in the description for it. So I'm now going to show you my tamed chickens. Um. So yeah, here we go. Uh, these are the diamond chickens. Diamond chickens. They drop diamonds when tamed instead of eggs, which is cool. And also, when they drop diamonds, you may have heard it while I was talking, or I may have been talking too loud for you to hear it. It makes a little zing sound. You may have heard it just then. It's like a little magical zing. The zing of diamonds. Then we have the emerald chicken, which, of course, drops emeralds. You would think that it would be the emeralds that made the sound, since emeralds are the rarest to find in Minecraft, but no. No, it's the diamonds. Okay, now we have the gold and the iron. So, gold. There you go. 
and the iron over here. These guys. Uh, let me see. Uh, also, uh, I'll I'll explain taming these when when I'm done showing you all of them. But typically, they will follow you when you're holding what they drop. They don't like to do it for. Oh wait, no, yeah, they're they're starting to do it. They start. Yeah, they they started to do it a little bit. Oh my god, these ladders are a pain in my butt. But they kept trying to escape, so I had to, you know, make them pits. Okay, here are the lapis chickens. Lapis. That one's a little darker than the others. Weird. These are the cookie chickens. Drop cookies. Look at them, they're like zebras. They all mesh in with each other. Then we have the redstone and the coal chickens. And there's a geodude in here. It, it's been in here for a while. I'm just letting it do its thing. Don't don't mind it. And more more geodude. Again, just uh, ignore them. And here are the cold chickens. And okay. So now that I'm at the end of those, all of those chickens are tamed and bred by feeding them what they drop. So, say you want a diamond chicken, you have to tame it by feeding it diamonds, and then you breed them by feeding it more diamonds. And same goes for the rest. Now, these two back here work a little bit differently. There's a zoo bat. Great. Okay, so these two work a little bit differently. What they drop is not what you use to tame them. Okay, so first we have the skeleton chicken. You tame these by feeding them bones. You tame and breed them by feeding them bones. Do that, get out of my way. There's Zubat and more Geodude. Oh my lord. I have to clean this up. And then here are the Ender Chickens. They are adorable. Um, and you breed and tame them by feeding them eyes of ender. So they're very difficult to get. Now, I have not personally seen these spawn in my game. That, oh, and I have some regular chickens over here. I have not seen any of these uh, spawn naturally in my game. I don't know if it's because of all the other mods that I have, or if it's because they don't spawn naturally yet. I know that this is a work in progress mod, so I'm not sure. But yeah, that is the um that's the Mo chickens. That those are the more chickens. Uh and there's one other one that I haven't shown you, but you'll see it in a minute. When I go and battle them. But I will not be battling them in the overworld. I will be battling them in the Lion King universe. I have the Lion King mod installed, and I'll explain that later. I will see you there. Okay, so now I'm going to show you how destructive these chickens are. As I said, we are in the Lion King universe. Uh, this is the Lion King dimension from the Lion King mod. Um, it's it's a it's a fun little place. I mean. We have cool different trees, you have different animals, you get uh, different types of food here, and also there is a, um, for Lion King fans, there is a storyline. I like it just because of the different animals and because it's just a different world to explore. Um, but this is my death pit. I made this for killing rhinos and alligators, and now for killing chickens that want to murder my face. Um, the way this is going to work is I am going to put a ladder up in here so I can show you what they do and then get out so that they can't kill me. 
and then I can kill them while I'm safe away from the chickens. Okay. So, th this is how I figure would be the best way to do this, on account of the fact that last time I tried this, I died like ten times. Okay, so I'm in survival. So, let's go up here first. Okay, now let's spawn. Let's spawn in the, uh, the diamond chicken first. If I want it, let me. I may need to make this a level higher. Or I could just make this a level lower, right? Yeah, that works. Okay. There. Now I'm safely away from the chickens, and I'll be able to show you what what they do. Uh, and hopefully not get killed. Okay. So let's go with the diamond chicken first. Boom. There he is. Oh wait, I forgot. Normal. Done. Back to game. Okay. Now, there it goes. Now he's coming back for me. Okay. If I go down here. Okay. Okay. So, he does slowness and blindness. So, this little thing's bastard. I have an overpowered sword to fight these things because there's no other way to do it. And I have my morph mod on. I thought that we had solved this problem the last time I got my butt kicked by all these things. Look, they're all here because they all killed me. Okay. Next we'll go with the uh the coal chicken. Oh, he's a cute little guy, isn't he? Okay. I don't know what he did, but he did something. He did he did slowness. Okay. So the cold chicken does slowness. And he doesn't have that much health. Okay. Now the iron chicken. Now the iron chicken does poison for reasons I don't understand I'm not gonna die from a chicken this time not happening alright glad we came to an understanding okay, now now for the gold chicken and wait for my health to come back. <laughs> that fester down there. Uh, but yeah, as you can see, this is why I have the, the sword. These chickens are not friendly in any sense of the word. Okay, I think I'm good there. Let's go! Oh, that, okay, it does blindness as well. Wow, this method really works. I don't know why I didn't think of this earlier. And there's a rhino in the death pit. Okay. So, because of the rhino, I wasn't able to show you everything that does, so going back in. Okay, so, okay, it just does blindness. That's all it does. I apologize for the rhino. That was rude of him. Okay. So now for the lapis. This one is 
probably the most harmless of them. They only do uh, about yeah, they only do half a heart of damage. They they just do slowness. They're not very strong. I wouldn't be too worried about these little guys. Lapis ones are pretty nice. Okay. The redstone ones are, are kind of crazy. Bonsai! They light you on fire. And it looks like, yeah, they light you on fire and they give you speed. You gave me drugs, man. No. This is wrong. Wow, I have not died once. I am surprised. No, no, no. Um, I think it's... I don't remember this command. I can't see either. Uh... No, no. Okay. Back here? No, you don't belong. Uh, oh well, I guess we're doing this in the dark. I don't know what spawns. Well, I think hyenas spawn in the dark, but I can take care of them easy. Okay, now we have the ender chicken. I mean, the emerald chicken. And it causes, uh, nausea, and I believe, yeah, just nausea. Whoa. Oh, uh, yep, yep, there's the hyena. And I died. And I think I turned into a hyena. Well, that's not too bad considering. It could have been worse. Okay. So, you're still there. He causes nausea. And he has a lot of health. Okay. So now for the others. The Ender Chicken, the Cookie Chicken, the Giant Chicken, which is the one I didn't show you, and the Skelly Chicken. Okay, let's do the Ender Chicken first. The Ender Chicken basically behaves like an Enderman. So if I go down here, it's going to give me blindness, it can teleport. Yeah, it, it can teleport. Um... I don't know where it went. I don't think it matters. Then we have the cookie chicken. Which will attack you. And give you speed and nausea. Again, I don't know why they would attack me and give me speed. I don't understand that, but... I guess sugar? And also, cookie chickens will drop not only chicken and egg, but also sugar. So that's kind of cool. They drop sugar. Okay, now the skeleton chicken. And I don't think me being up here is going to really affect... going to help me at all. Or, actually... No, it doesn't seem to be able to hurt me from up here. The skeleton chicken shoots arrows. And that's it. It, it shoots arrows. And now for the big kahuna. Quite literally. Um, this is the giant chicken. It has its name for a reason. I really don't, I do not want to be in this pit. That's a hyena. Yeah, that's right, you stay away from me. No! God dang! I am so sorry about this, guys. You know, I tell them no, and they don't listen. One bad thing about doing this at night. There's another one. Oh my god. It's face. Yeah, that's the Ed Hyena. I, I said to change back into me. Okay. Anyway, back to the matter at hand. 
the giant chicken. The big kahuna. Quite literally, it is a monster. I am not ready to battle this. You may look at its glory while I get my hope back. This thing will kill you. Again, I've never seen one of these spawn. Okay. okay. As you can see, it's kicking my ass. Run. It gives you poison, slowness, and blindness. Ugh. And it drops that. And those are some hyena bones. And yeah, that is the Mo Chickens mod. Um. Yeah. It, it, I'm I'm glad I did this here instead of in my world. Um, so yeah, that's, that's the Mo Chickens mod, that's what they do, that's all the chickens, um, again, I do not know how to tame the giant chicken, I am unaware of how that is done. I'm getting out of here. But it is cool, um, because you get all these awesome chickens that drop all very useful things. So, uh, the, uh, as I said, the mod, um, link, the link to the mod will be in the description. Getting a bit of lag. And yeah, I'll see you guys later.